Uh, my name is Vignesh. Um, I'm on the MBA project. Uh, um, and um, I used to be a consultant before this. So our uh, global consulting project was uh, with Gulf Tena, uh, which is a terminal port operating company. Um, they are located in Sharjah. Um, and um, the thing that we had to do with them was primarily try to identify uh, mergers and acquisition targets. Um, so uh, we kind of started off working uh, in Cambridge for a couple of weeks and then traveled over there for a couple of weeks. Uh, um, and uh, and it, I think it went well. We had quite a diverse team, uh, both in terms of geographies and in terms of functions. So we had a couple of people who had freight forwarding experience or like maritime experience, um, you know, one from Kazakhstan, Gulam, and uh, Pang from Thailand. Um, and then there were a couple of people who brought in a lot of financial experience. Uh, so Pedro from Brazil and, uh, um, let me think, uh, Peter from uh, Canada, China. And um, the final one was me, so I was the marketeer slash consultant uh, from India slash UK. So it was quite diverse to kind of you know bring in these different perspectives, um, you know, brainstorm together, and then sometimes you know have the storming forming uh, things that we hear in management practice from Keith. So that was nice. The main challenge we had was um, that we work with a private entity, so the client was a privately held company, and most of the targets we were evaluating were also privately held entities. So the question was, how do you do valuation for companies you know, which don't have financial information available out there? So that's from a technical standpoint. But from a, from a team standpoint, I think we, we work pretty well. So we kind of you know, opened a conversation with the client and then tried to work with them closely. Um, to kind of overcome these barriers. Uh, so it turned out pretty well. For me, a good consultant is, uh, is someone who can structure the problem very well. Um, and so we, together as a team, we worked you know, well in that sense. You know, we kind of took a step back and said, so this is what the client wants, so what can we bring to the project? So structure the problem very well, communicate it to the client clearly, this is what we're going to do, these are the challenges that we have, and so you know you can use this as a starting point. So you know, kind of having an open conversation with the client and you know structuring the problem really, really clearly and you know setting expectations. That was you know that I think like encompasses you know uh, a good consultant and uh, I think, yeah, I think we, we kind of did some of that, hopefully. What we were more proud of was primarily uh, actionable recommendations. So we told the client five companies that they have to target to acquire um, and told them in the short term who are the appropriate targets, in the medium term who are the appropriate targets, in the long term if they have a high ticket, you know, if they have fina equity financing, who would be the right people to acquire. So, um, so being actionable was probably you know, the biggest success in our project.